Hello my beauties, today I will be showing you this new makeup look that I do basically every single day when I'm going out to run errands or just out and don't want to leave my house with a bare face. It only takes me 15 minutes and it makes you look so much better and so awake. So what we're doing is I'm mixing my Maybelline Fit Me foundation and my L'Oreal True Match and I'm going to blend that in with a dual fiber brush by BH Cosmetics. I am then going in with one of my favorite concealers. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in shade Medium Moyen. And I love this concealer because the consistency is so light and it gives you like a really natural look, which is what we're going for. It also brightens up the eye perfectly. And I'm going to go in with a beauty blender and blend that in. Using our Forever Nudes palette, I'm going to use the yellow shade just to set the concealer because I do tend to crease a lot, so that's going to help set it. And then later on, we will be using the more brownish shade just to warm up the face a little bit since today we are not going to contour. Using the same concealer, I'm going to apply it in my eyelids and I'm just using that as a base for the shadows that I'm going to use. And I'm using the L'Oreal Nudes palette and I'm gonna use that dark shade it's like a taupey brown and I'm just gonna apply it all over the crease just to give you a little bit of definition using the same L'Oreal palette I'm gonna go in and use this bronzy kind of pinkish gold shimmery shade and I'm gonna apply it all over the lid using a flat brush and then I'm gonna go in using the lightest shade in the palette and apply it in the center of our lid that's gonna create some brightness and make our eyes look more awake You want to go back and blend your shadow and then we're going to go in with our black eyeliner and just defining our lash line just to darken it up a bit. We're not creating a cat eye or anything like that. You just want to create some definition and you want to do that with the upper lash line and your bottom lash line as well. For brows, I'm going to use this tinted brow gel by BH Cosmetics and this is going to help me look a little bit more natural and give some color into my brows without making it look so harsh. For the inner corner highlight, you want to go back and use that same light shade we used before and bring it down to the bottom lash line just to create more of an awake look and it also helps brighten up the eye. For mascara, I'm gonna use this CoverGirl mascara um, and just apply it in the bottom and upper lash lashes. Going back into this palette, I'm going to be using the two brown shades and I'm going to use it just to warm up the face. I'm not going to contour. This is just to give me some definition and some warmth into my face. And then I'm going to go in with the same blush that's there and I'm going to apply it just in the apples of my cheeks to give me some color. This is such a pretty blush. 
it brings out the whole look without making it look too intense. For lips, I'm gonna go with this Jordana lip pencil, and I'm, it's like a nude pink color. And then on top of that, I'm gonna go with a Jordana lipstick and apply it all over my lips. And then I'm gonna use a lip gloss just because I don't want this look to look matte. This lip color is so pretty as an everyday look. It's so natural, and it goes with the whole look that we're going for today. For highlight, I'm gonna use the same shimmery shade that we used all over our lids. And I'm just gonna apply it in the tip of my nose and the highest points of my cheeks. I don't want this to be an intense highlight, so I'm using just my finger and I'm blending it in slightly. This is the whole look. If you like it, don't forget to like this video. Please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!